What's up guys? When it comes to bringing power lines across a river, a lake, or any body of water for that matter, there's a few common methods, but this thing I saw last weekend, it was quite a bit different. So I wanted to share that with you guys. So usually when you have to bring power lines across a body of water, if there's a bridge there, you can run ducks across the bridge and use regular underground cables uh, attach them to the bridge like we see here. So this would be a couple runs of 12,470 volt cables. It's the exact same setup as underground, except it's fixed to the side of the bridge or underneath. Sometimes you'll see a river crossing overhead where they have a just a typical structure. It's usually built a little bit different. They might use heavier gauge wire, maybe build a three pole structure instead of a single pole structure. Guys on both ends, depending on the distance the wire's crossing. Probably the largest crossing I've got in my area for overhead would be a thousand meters. That's one kilometer. That one is a 138,000 volt high line on some very tall towers. I was actually on top of one of those towers probably about 16 years ago. Awesome view. Oftentimes you'll see these orange triangles, orange balls as a marker for boats, planes, or whatever on these river crossings. But now last week while I was on vacation, we were out in the boat, we're going down the river and we're coming up to this bridge and man, I had to laugh. There's a three phase line and rather than run underground cables on the bridge, they bolted the poles to the bridge. Probably looked like maybe 30 foot wooden poles, three phase construction. They're fastened right to the bridge. Um, all kinds of clearance for the lines. I mean, it, it works, it works great. There's nothing wrong with this installation whatsoever. Just first time I've seen it. I wanted to share that with you guys. Let me know in the comments if you've ever seen this before. All right, guys, thanks for watching. I'm going to head back inside. We still got a few more days vacation left. Hope to see you soon.